Illusional self-confidence is the lemon brand. You won the mini challenge, so you will be team captains. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> So have you ever walked in heels before? I have not. Okay, step one. <laughs> I love a bratty pageant princess. That's a fit. <laughs> I love pageants. Oh, that's very this. I hate that. <laughs> Thank you. But that literally looks like- I would take you on a date and I'd be proud to walk around with you. You still can. Get a room. 1506. Uh, yes, it. Hello, Lemon. Hi, Angel. What? So I got Miss Fitz, mm. bratty pageant princess. No. <laughs> when things don't go exactly my way, I'm very like, <laughs> no. Oh. So I'm very excited. I am a straight up motherfucking rap strip. You have a lot in your you. head. <sighs> Thank you. <laughs> Brooklyn has dealt with the same thing and look where she is. Clearly, I just need to focus on myself because everyone else already is. Everyone wants to be a dwarf, but they a troll. Lemon is also a spoiled princess, so I feel like her and Miss Fitz would get along. <laughs> I am so gagged that Ali X is here. And really think like gay wrist. Like let it. Here, I love her. I've seen her live before, and she's a fucking powerhouse. In terms of the choreography, I know I am saying that. I am that bitch, and I am serving it to you. Other girls aren't quite getting it as quickly as I would hope they would. Aren't they just death drop gorgeous? I would like to thank my father for his endless financial contributions. Thank you so much. Enjoy this show. I think you look beautiful. I always love when a pageant girl's real talent is pageants. So I think mine is the funniest, like, talent portion that you could possibly choose. Oh! 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 Alona's character is very unlikable. Oh! oh. oh. Daddy! I hope everyone thought I looked like her <laughs> sexy mother. Let's go in home tonight! I think potentially Scarlett is just a little bit jealous of how well Bo is being perceived by the judges, but that's not her fault. <laughs> Tensions are high in the workroom today. I feel like Scarlett thinks that she didn't win because of Alona last week. I think Alona hasn't really delivered any comedy. I think she's kind of taking that out on her right now. Which is really, which is really funny. <laughs> I have to show the judges that I'm not messy and I can build a silhouette. Michelle Dubarry is not only a Canadian icon, but she is a drag legend. She is the oldest working drag queen in the world, and she honestly is the coolest person I've ever met. Have you ever gotten so litty, you've splitted your kitty? <laughs> Scarlett and Alona both love to get the last word, so this fight might never end. <laughs> is Lemon. I am serving you perfect pageant five-year-old realness. Lemon loves pageants, arts and crafts, and tap dancing. When she grows up, she wants to win Canada's Drag Race. I'm gonna win Ultimate Grand Supreme. I just know it. And my mom said if I did, she'd take me for a poutine. I'm back in the Thank competition! You. I feel so good. <gasps> oh my god. Congratulations to Lemon. Oh yes. Thank you very our much. Our doll, our literal doll. Look, this competition's getting intense as hell. Bitch, you've already lip synced twice. The third lip sync is the kiss of death. <laughs> Girls have been constantly doubting me in this competition, and I just got my second maxi challenge win, and I'm not done. This is gonna be really easy. I'm gonna read Priyanka to Phil. <laughs> oh, fuck. Pri, why do you always ask what your name is? Because everyone thinks I'm damn Tanomi. Even the judges, that's why they keep putting me in the bottom. <laughs> We're blowing kisses, we're living sissies, and we feel fucking stunning. Did you do a reveal during the Snatch Game? Yeah, I revealed that wasn't a threat. <laughs> I can already tell you're a fucking light, you know what I mean? I'm so excited so to be sisters. <laughs> and I won last week's episode, so I'm on a roll. <laughs> <laughs> I am proud as fuck to be Canadian. I love this country and what it stands for. My drag sister's name is going to be Lime. Get it? Rabal has never walked in heels before, so right now he walks like Jimbo, but I'm gonna turn him into Naomi Campbell. The secret 
to walking in heels and posing and feeling yourself in drag is to just believe in yourself. Right, left, yes, bitch. Honestly, like if you think you look sickening, you do. I'm so happy to be sharing this moment with my sister. The bitch looks 110% different. Like, she had a full beard and the bushiest eyebrows you've ever seen. Do you remember that, baby? If I was wearing that bodysuit, they would have literally ripped it off me like Cinderella stepsisters. Are y'all watching the same show I'm watching? Those are probably the ugliest fucking runways that have been on this entire season, but I'm not a fucking judge. It's a new day in the workroom and all of these bitches hate me, so I'm gonna send them packing. <laughs> Ugh, I'm gonna be bitter forever. <laughs> yes! Sometimes the mean girl in the movie has a kind heart. I'm gonna miss her so much.